Welcome back to the Gun Collective. I'm John. I run this thing. And uh, you're inside my office. It's a mess. Yeah, it's always a mess. That's just the way it is. My brain is a mess. My desk is a mess. There's stuff everywhere. But the point of today is this thing has to go. This absolutely has to go. This is an old relic of an old time. There's not enough room on it. It's not versatile enough. And long story short, it's just, it's got to go. I got something cool. This is being replaced by something from a brand called Hold Up Displays. They reached out and said, hey, we want to do a whole bunch of stuff with you. And I said, all right, let's start with replacing this organizer in my office. So first things first, I've got to take the guns out of here. So that's that. Now I've got to take this off the wall. This is pretty exciting for me because this is customized. So Hold Up Displays does these like wall mounts. And I'm going to cut this open and show you guys. It'll make a lot more sense when it's hung up on the wall, but this is pretty cool. Let's just come apart. So I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's two pieces here, and they're shoved together. I think I've got to get a mallet or something to knock them apart, because uh, those are fit really, really tight. Let's do that. Instead of a mallet, I've got a band hammer. This, there we go. Just, just a slight tap, and they come apart. Yep. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to tell what this is from there, but that might be a little bit of a giveaway. I posted pictures of this on my Instagram. Alright, basically, it just says, attach these bastards to the wall like this. Oh, they're numbered. Are they numbered? Hey, they're numbered! Alright, cool. So we're going to try to do this and not screw it up. Two things. It's now super hot, so I have the air conditioner on, deal with the noise and I had to get the level, and I had to go to Home Depot to get drill bits, because I had a wood drill bit and it broke, and blah, 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 blah. You gotta pre-drill these. They go in easy once you do that, but let's go ahead and get the rest of them mounted. All right, so there it is. From Hold Up Displays, this is one of their kits. They did this custom for me. I know they do an American flag version that's pretty BA, and I'm sure you can get just about any logo on there. I'm sure they would charge a little extra for that, but you could do it for your gun room. This is pretty cool. It's, it's aluminum, it's slat wall, but it's a lot more uh, modular it feels like than the previous setup. What's interesting is these mounts here will actually pivot off of the base so if you wanted to like push them into a corner and rotate them out you could do that. That's cool. I got dad's 22. It's not a nice gun. It's not but this matters to me. I've got the Yeet Cannon, the Deagle and the Agency there and of course some other stuff. You know a little carry gun with a bitty on it. Got a lot going on here. I do think I need to get more mounts. I could probably tighten up these long guns. They look nice spaced out right now, but I could probably tighten them up, tighten them up and maybe fit two to three more in there. A bunch more handguns. But for now, this is a cool setup, and I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of something behind the scenes here in the TGC offices. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know, leave a like, subscribe, all that sort of nonsense that everybody begs for at the end of a video. Otherwise, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.